the Beckhams now, aren't they? They are an amazing family, very much together. I think it was, I think it was well said by, by, by Victoria when she said that, you know, her and David, they have lots of rubbish and lies thrown at them. It's just that they're a brand, aren't they? And a brand that is successful, they don't want to lose that brand. So I think, you know, through thick and thin, they will remain together. What they're like at home on their own, it's a bit of a guessing game, isn't it? But as far as I'm concerned, uh, V and D, they are going to be together for a long time to come. Prince Harry and the lovely Meghan. Um, they will definitely have a family and I feel that, that we could get an announcement where that's concerned before the end of the year. I'm looking at them, not necessarily the public, but them finding out that they will have a baby by the end of this year. When they announce that, that could be next year, early next year. You haven't seen the last of, of our lovely KP. She's going places. She's a better person. It's like anyone, you know, when you have, when you have a bit of a downer, it, it's not about the problem it's how you handle it. Katie is going to handle it okay. She's been round the block a few times. She's learnt some lessons. She's going to be back on track. Yeah, Cheryl, Cheryl Cole, she's a little sweetie, you know. And um, I've seen Cheryl, she's been to my house. So Cheryl is is what I call, um, she, she's, she's very much an old client, is, is Cheryl, even though she's young. She is, at the moment, uh, not necessarily in a good place um, emotionally. She will come out okay. December's a very important month for Cheryl, and I think that we'll hear uh, a lot of good news around her then. As a prediction, a Sally Morgan prediction, you haven't seen the last of Big Brother. I truly believe it will be picked up by another channel. So, uh, you know, watch this space. If you haven't seen the end of Big Brother, it's coming back. Uh, this is a prediction for Ryland, he's not expecting this, but I think Ryland will move on quite swiftly and be snapped up by one of the more popular channels. So he isn't going to, you could say, be out of work. Emma isn't either. And I think that Emma has America in her life. So she may do a stint on a particular show and find that she's offered other work while she's out there doing that. Uh, my only thoughts on Roxanne are really ones of, I so want her to get help. I do think for Roxanne, it may take as long as two years for her to feel that she's faced her demons.